Hello everyone and welcome to Pragmac. Today I want to talk to you about LG's signature laptops, the LG Gram, and they've been recently updated for 2021. The LG Gram is an ultra sleek, ultra portable laptop which attempts to maximize productivity without having to maximize size. However, it does have some very large model sizes, including a 17 inch. The thin and light laptop lineup is being brought into 2021 with the the new 11th generation Intel Core processors. And along with some changes to the trackpad and keyboard, the LG Gram keeps its essence. For just a touch of history, the original LG Gram was launched in 2016 and actually came in just two sizes, a 13.3 inch and a 14 inch device. However, for this model year, there is a total of five models being announced. They come in three sizes, 17 inch, 16 inch, 14 inch, and the 16 and 14 inch models have 360 degree hinges, enabling a full two in one design. And throughout the device, LG is focused on keeping productivity first. There are very thin bezels on this device. And this year they've enlarged the keyboard and the touchpad, which is a welcome change and another way of maximizing real estate and putting productivity first. Powering these new devices are the 11th generation Intel Core processors with Iris Xe graphics. And these laptops are also Intel Evo verified, meaning that they are able to take advantage of the energy management features presented by Intel, which include fast wake and enhanced battery management so that you can squeeze out a maximum. Of, and that's really what Intel Evo technology is all about. It's about stretching out the battery life and helping out with that battery life management. Having a look at the display, all all of the different sizes come with a 1610 aspect ratio, which LG says is focused around productivity, as it does offer a taller screen than most laptops in today's 16.9 dominated laptop market. LG has made sure to maximize the screen size by having very small bezels on all sides. LG's ultra narrow bezels and hidden hinge are designed to give what they say is a 90% screen to body ratio. The 17 inch model does not have a touch variation. However, the 16 and the 14 inch models, they do come with that 360 degree hinge for a pure convertible tablet experience. And they also include a stylus. And a quick look at the scales. With the 17 inch model coming in at 2.98 pounds, the 16 inch model coming in at 2.62 pounds, and finally the smallest model, the 14 inch coming in at 2.2 pounds. For ports, all of the LG Grams are very well equipped. They come with two USB-C Thunderbolt 4, two USB Type-A 3.2 ports, a micro SD card reader, and an HDMI port, which gives great selection for anyone who doesn't want to have to deal with lugging around a bunch of dongles. One of the things that I really appreciate about LG with all of these different models, for consumers, comparing these laptops makes it fairly simple. LG keeps the core configuration the same, and and you just need to decide what size of a display you're interested in. The only thing is if you had wanted a 17 inch convertible style laptop with that 360 degree hinge, um, maybe next year. The only letdown I had on paper with these devices was on the 14 inch models. Unfortunately, the 14 inch LG Grams have a lower display resolution than I would have liked to have seen, which is 1920 by 1200. And comparing that to to the larger 16 inch and 17 inch models, they are equipped with 2560 by 1600 resolution displays. So that really is quite a bump up in resolution and that would be the only sticking factor with maybe going with the smaller display. I know on a 14 inch screen, it's not gonna have as much of an impact as on a 16 or 17 inch display. That being said, a lot of 14 inch models are packing in high and higher resolutions these days and I think you could make full use of that on a 14 inch device. So it's unfortunately that there wasn't a choice or isn't a variation or model to upgrade that screen on the smallest LG Gram. Leaving the resolution aside, LG has done a really good job equipping these laptops with a great IPS display with a P3 color gamut. I think there's going to be some value added there for photographers, for anybody doing video editing where 
color is very important. Thank you everyone. Thank you for listening to my thoughts. Please let me know what you think about the updates to the LG Gram. If you have a preference for size, do you think the 17 inch is the way to go? Or is it better to be on the 14 inch side on the smaller portability side? And how many people are interested in the convertible aspect in being able to use it as more of a tablet as a two in one with that stylus? Leave your comments below. If you enjoyed this video and maybe if you didn't, why don't you consider subscribing anyway? Maybe you'll enjoy the next one a little bit more. And again, thank you from Pragmat.